So here I was, I was up catching one of these big winter storms in the North Cascades in Washington State, and I'm up about 5,000 feet elevation, way up in the mountains. This solid snowstorm coming in, it's dumping feet of snow. And I'm thinking, man, I've got this sweet ultimate battery set up now, I'm solid. And at about 11 o'clock at night, I finally finished my, my episode and all the filming and all the cooking, it's a lot of work. And I go to crawl inside and everything's shut down. My batteries are like at almost zero within less than a day. And I'm like, wait, I should be good to go for like days and days with the setup that I just installed. But then quickly realizing that because of the cold and because of how lead acid works, it becomes so inefficient and it lost all this power and basically left me with barely enough power to, to run my lights and I slept uh, out there in the freezing cold. It was like 25 degrees Fahrenheit and I was hunkered up under my blankets because that system left me high and dry. One of the great things that they've implemented into these batteries that I've got, which I've actually got some of the first off the production line, is that they now have a built-in heating system so that when it drops below a certain temperature, that heating system kicks back in, warms up those batteries, and then you can be recharging on the go without having to worry about damaging your batteries. And ever since that time of dealing with those lead acids in the cold, it was constantly lingering over my shoulders of, oh man, do I have enough power? Am I gonna make it through this next trip? Where am I at? And that, that's the battery anxiety. And so getting my hands on the Battleborn lithium batteries and creating this solid system, all of a sudden, all that battery anxiety is gone because everything's so solid. You know it's gonna work. You know it's something that you can depend on. That's important for me because not only is it me just huddling up in the cold, my whole production depends on these batteries and the power that comes from it. And if I don't have that, then I don't have my YouTube channel.